Yeah. Good evening, everyone. It is Tuesday, June 9th, and we are here, and uh, it has been a crazy day. I just have to say I'm, again, absolutely humbled and blown away at all of the you just turned the flashlight I, on I'm, me. I'm sorry. I'm it's trying just to, like the, the bright the bright lights I'm hit me. I'm trying to lighten it up a little bit. I <laughs> yeah. guess it's just not working. Yeah. Um, a little dark, guys. Sorry. Anyway, yeah. Thank you so much, everybody that uh, commented on my birthday thing. And uh, just crazy. I went in there to start looking at it a little while ago. And there was 312 um, comments on my uh, on my Facebook page which is just incredible very humbling and so thank you guys so much uh, I love you all I just uh, really appreciate the the kind words and the thinking about me I appreciate that so uh, we started the day off um, well Vicky and once Vicky got up we went to the <laughs> I started my day off a little earlier than that answering emails and whatnot but I still got emails I gotta answer. Sophia says happy birthday Papa. Hey Ophie I gotta call you later so let me know if you're gonna be available I gotta give you a call on the phone um, but anyway once Vicky got up we got moving around uh, we went out to the lake and I did not get skunked today. Last two weeks I've got skunked out there but this one was just a little one he was only like 10 11 inches long but a uh, nice little bass and it was fun it was a little it got a little choppy and a little windy after a while we were only out there a couple hours but went to a new spot and uh, I'm gonna lift this up and see if I can get some more backlight sorry guys backlight just just like well I can move if you no, need me to fine. look at you all right Is that better yeah, it is better. Anyway, uh, so I uh, spent Dan my birthday. Dan Yoda said, I figured out what your project is. It's to mount your fish. <laughs> yeah, yeah, to mount the fish. No, he's back in the lake. I. <laughs> that's funny. No, it'll have to be a different fish other than this. He's back in the lake now. And I'm almost always catch and release. And that's a big board for such a tiny little fish. <laughs> yeah, it would have to be a much bigger fish than that for sure. Although the picture makes it look big, but that's actually like actual size. It's about 9, 10, 11 inches long. Um, but it was fun. Uh, I always have fun out there when I don't capsize, and I didn't capsize today, so it was a good day. Anyway, so um, I don't, it, I think this is going to be pretty quick, guys. I had uh, Tim uh, Forsick actually wrote me an email uh, a week or two ago and says I've been using wax paper for my inkjet image transfer and it appears to be working pretty well the benefit of wax paper over the freezer paper is that the image can be viewed um, to some degree which helps in centering the projects have you tried wax paper and I had not tried wax paper but today I did um, so let me show you uh, this is actually a uh, some artwork there's an ant on my board some artwork that Jerry Gibbs sent me uh, and I printed it out on wax paper and uh, just did a real quick transfer and I gotta say I was pretty impressed I didn't put uh, silicon spray or anything like that on here I literally just printed it out my regular standard uh, DPI's whatever the standard is with my inkjet printer and just uh, scraped it on there and it uh, I really like the idea that, uh, the fact that you can see through the paper and it actually as you as you rub on that thing it actually shows it gets darker and shows that it's uh, that it's transferring so I'm actually going to do a demo on a different transfer so uh, anyway Thank you so much, Tim, for sending that. But here I have a just a little piece of artwork. It's some pine cones. And this is actually, yeah, this, yeah, let me look here. I think you can print on either side, but that I'm not sure of. So I'm just going to lay this down here. 
and hopefully it won't blow away. Away. I know better than that. I know better not than to trust the wind. Um, anyway, let's see what happens here. Actually, it's got a mark on that thing too. But let me see. So um, on this wax paper, literally, we went to Walmart today. I picked up some wax paper, a buck sixty-four, and this is uh, seventy-five square feet. So it's quite a bit cheaper than the freezer paper sheets that I've been using. Hi, and uh, now I don't know whether this is going to end up being my favorite, but I think it it certainly is an alternative. For people that want to do it, and I just ripped it, of course. That's the thing, that, because that wax paper is so thin. But that other one, I was, like, really rubbing the heck out of it. Didn't have any problem with it at all. But maybe I've just got a sharp edge on that thing or something. But, uh, yeah, it's a lot cheaper than the freezer paper. And I love the idea that you can see through it. And it, uh, now... Here's the thing, that one I did, and it was uh, literally within probably 10 minutes, I actually did the transfer. I printed this probably about an hour and a half ago, so we'll see. It doesn't look like it's transferring as well as that one did. Normally speaking, with the freezer paper, you've got an hour or two that you could work with it. So let's see if this is, this is going to work. I don't know. This will only be my second one. Yeah. Wow. Well, not bad. I kind of, right there, I kind of lessened up because it ripped on me a little bit. And again, the silicone spray that I put on my freezer paper, it may work on here. I don't know. Lewis, now, I'm sorry. Louis Bryan says, how do you run the wax paper through the printer? So I just cut it. I literally cut it in in eight and a half by eleven pieces, and I put Hi, the. And for me, I put uh, it kind of. It has a little bit of a curl, but it doesn't have as much of a curl as the freezer paper that we used originally before we got the sheets, which was a couple years ago. So I put the curl up because it feeds through and then it prints on the other side. I think it will print on either side. Again, guys, this is I've only been playing with this for about an hour. Um, but all in all, I think it makes a pretty good transfer. And I love the fact that you can see through it. Now, I will say that I, I cut like five or six different pieces. And a couple of them <coughs> that I put the curl down... Um, and tried to feed through it jammed up in the printer it only took a couple seconds to clear it when I put the curl where they had a little bit of a curl up and then it fed through it fed through fine now I've seen videos there's videos out there and things that say if you tape this to another piece uh, of regular paper it gives it the rigidity that you won't have any any problems with it. But that I don't know. I haven't tried that. I just thought this seemed like a good deal to kind of share with you guys today. But all in all, made a pretty good transfer. I'm kind of happy with it. So I may be playing around with this. I like that. Huh? I wonder if I could make a... I, uh, I carved that on a sign. Uh, uh, Lee Harrington says, wonder if you could use the iron with the wax paper to transfer it. I don't know, Lee. I think the heat might be a problem. Melt that wax. Um, generally, I think of heat as being a laser printer, uh, printing with a laser printer because it uses heat. So I think that heat, and I have tried the heat. I've got a video where I tried the heat with uh, with an inkjet printer in the freezer paper, and it really didn't work out too well. It was this was a much better. Uh, a much better transfer by just rubbing it on there. So um, I've got one other thing that I want to try, but I'll do that on a separate video, separate time. But anyway, thanks so much, Tim. Uh, I'm actually going to play around with this. Now, will this work using rapid resizer when you... Uh, oh. 
Get them, Mag. Somebody's here. Um, will this work when you're doing a rapid resizer and printing out tiles? That I don't know. I haven't printed more than just one. Um, Okay, there we go. Jeez. <laughs> oh, oh, lovely. Lovely. That's, yes. It's his birthday! Hey, guys. <laughs> All right, so nothing like live, uh, live broadcast. I'm surprised. It was, uh, yeah. Happy that's birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. You're happy happy birthday, birthday oh, look to at that. you. Look at that. Vikings colors and everything. Yes. All right. Lovely. <laughs> awesome. Oh, man. That's awesome. Thanks, guys. Oh. Hey, Hold on. Ophie. <laughs> what is this? It's a little addition. <laughs> it's the new version. Special. <laughs> All right. Well, sorry, guys. we got to go. Um, <laughs> Yeah, this is great. Oh, thank you. Well, this it did say lovely. happy birthday. Now it just says off. happy cake. <laughs> just happy. Just happy. So, just happy. This was as close to a birthday party as I could plan. This is, is uh, yeah. Well, it was a surprise. I didn't think Ryan we'd be doing this happy live. Happy birthday, Dad. Thank you, Ryan. Okay. Uh, no, you yeah. got to keep it on. Well, I just wanted to see we what it was. We spent money on that. We spent <laughs> good, good money on all right, that. All right, all right, I'll put it back on. All right, you guys get over there by Papa. Uh, watch out for all my crap. All right, guys, you get to share in the birthday party. Yeah. Woo! So this is the family. Uh, we have more family in California, but, you yeah, know, this is the, the desert family. The desert family. The desert, Rachel? Yes. Oh, okay. So you guys... Uh, Hopefully, no Jacks probably already, and Xander, Hi. Xander's back Hi, there, Xander. Pops. and Rachel, and Sophia, and Jay in the back, the big guy in the back. Um, no, Eric. That's it, right? Yeah, oh, Eric's, Eric's at not work. here. Yeah. Eric's at work. Uh, Eric. Gwenny says, miss you guys so much. Happy birthday, Papa. Hi, Gwenny. Thank you, Gwenny. Hi, Gwen. Love you, Gwenny. We've been so. planning this for two weeks. We have a few weeks. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, Surprise! Yeah. <laughs> so, well, well, that's uh -oh. all right. Anyway, yeah. guys, we're going to make it short. Oh, we have Anemone and Jimmy and uh, Susie. And oh. Hi, guys. Stephanie says hi, Rachel. Hi, guys. Hi, Stephanie. What's and this? Ryan says the family that matters what is. Constant <laughs> 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 battle. <laughs> anyway, guys, sorry, we're, but we. Oh, Amy says hi, family. Love and miss you. Oh. Hi, sister. Uh, hi, Amy. Hey, All right, guys, we are gonna cut this short because we are gonna eat some birthday cake. We love yes. you, and we'll see you tomorrow. Love Bye. you guys. Bye. See you tomorrow.